guys, and welcome back to Moon's World for another Star Stable Wednesday update. So, today, I'll let you know right now, is not the um, next chapter of uh, Rescuing Anne. Uh, apparently, it's they're still working on that. So, in the meantime, we do have a visitor. Now, a lot of you have seen the uh, the Yorvik Wild Horses around. Um, some of you have... have probably don't know where they are he is back for the week so let me show you we all know where andy is right got andy's right there in for in fir grove so let me just show you where to go to find the yorvik wild horses now this is the road that leads up to fir grove or down to valedale okay so what you're going to do is you're going to pass andy and keep going down the hill Here they are, to your left. Now, as you see, I already have one. Um, so, I'm not going to be buying any today. Uh, for two reasons. One, I don't have enough star coins. Because we still have not had our double star coin. And I'm real low in star coins. So, there will be no buying of any of these. Besides, this is the one I like the best. The one I have here is Dust Dancer. Because to me, it looks like a sunset. Uh, so let's let's show you what, what they do have. We have this beautiful white one. Uh, this is a pastel rainbow. And when it's not magic, it is a gray horse with white mane, tail, and um, hoof, bell bottom. I call them bell bottoms because that's what they make me think of. But uh, so this is gray where it's white and white where it's rainbow. Okay, these are only 599 star coins. Um, they are not as fast as a regular horse. They are a little bit slower, but they're more fun. They cost less than a regular Shire, but they move like a Shire. They're built from a Shire model. Um, so whatever you could use a Shire for, you could use these for. Just I wouldn't recommend racing with them because they're not the fastest horses. But they're fun to ride for something different. Oh, my horse seems to like that one. He keeps looking at it. <laughs> and then, of course, we have the one I'm on now. Which you saw what it looks like. So this is kind of like, um... In, in its normal color. Thanks, guys. Just get right on top of me. In its normal coloration, it's, um... It's, a, it's the tan. It's like a buckskin, I guess you would call it. I don't know, buckskin done, I'm, I don't, to me it's buckskin, but whatever. Um, but anyway, these are five ninety nine. Now, uh, we've got something going on, and the next thing that they have, oh, let me let me just let you know the rest of the stuff. Uh, the horse market is unfortunately back at um, Jorvik Stables Arena, so there goes our dressage over there. Um, I would like to ask everybody, if you haven't already done it, Please mail Star Stable. Go to the, the help thing um, on their website and message them, contact them, and ask that they please not put the horse market at your Vic Stables Arena because that makes the riding hall get jammed because then nobody can go there to do their dressage. So um, if you do dressage, whether it be at the Yorvik Stables Arena or at the riding hall, please send uh, let's flood SSO with mail and ask them to please not put that horse market at Jorvik Stables Arena. Okay, that said, um, <clears throat> uh, let's see, I think that was it. Other than the quest, we do have a new quest. Um, however, unfortunately, this quest is going to leave out um, anybody who has not reached Epona. Because you do have to go to Epona to do it. Let me just make sure I got everything else. Farrah is still going to be here. Uh, she leaves on March 6th. So if you're looking for the little druid outfits, uh, you want to go to Valedale over by Elizabeth's house. And you can get those cute druid outfits that you've probably seen people riding around with. Um, 
a new feature if you have and I don't think I have one in here um, no I don't uh, if you have championship medals and have done like what I did and stacked them on top of each other uh, before you couldn't do anything about uh, moving them so that you could put it on your horse once you stacked them now all you have to do to do that is press down the shift key and you can drag and drop the item that you want to remove from the stack so you can now remove one from the stack so that you can put it on your horse if you choose to do that <coughs> uh, these horses are available for anybody that can get to this area there is no requirements Okay, now, the next thing about the quest that we did get. Um, the spider, uh, Alberta. Yeah, she's having babies. So if you don't like spiders, even the colorful, cartoony ones, um, then I wouldn't even bother doing this. Um, I'm not sure if this is going to give us any XP or anything. I don't know yet. Um, but let's go check out the quest, okay? So, if you look at your quest logs, see, look at this. Okay, this is all I have. Um, My Little Spiders is what it's called. You have to go to Professor Hayden at Mirror Marshes. So, I will meet you over at the professor. Okay, so. That's it for today's update. 